for any every woman who's trying to get pregnant or to leave her job or to find like you might have your husband like maybe you know who has more of a mathematical brain and who would tell you like okay what are those therapies how can they help you out etc so my husband has also seen uh, uh, has always encouraged me and not only that he has seen the shift himself in my uh, uh, in before and after the session and he's like that's why he's like i'm so great to linda you know like um even though i had different therapists before i mean he, he doesn't he tells me he doesn't give me his opinion usually it means that he's not that graceful about them but like <laughs> for you he's like i'm so grateful that linda is, is uh, you know with you um and um you know, helping you out and all that amazing work that we are having together. So, yeah. Every single day. Of course, I'm so happy to be pregnant and I'm and I'm enjoying it. But like, I would like to have more time to 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 you know take care of myself and of uh, baby Tara and you know to enjoy it. I'm just waking up. Literally, I, I give myself a few minutes to connect with Tara and then, you know, to do some dancing energy dance that I do in the morning, you know, some quality time for me. But then I rush to the uh, to my laptop to to work. Yeah. And so that's the, the current job I'm in. Mm. And uh, there's no promotion. There's nothing happening. So uh, so I feel like stuck, like having to work. Yeah. Having also uh, this prof- uh, like perfectionism in me. Um, that everything has to be, and also my ego a bit. I'm not letting go and I'm not willing to delegate at the same time. So that's mm. another issue. And what you truly uh, want to do is to have your own business, right? Yes. Yeah, so, and at the same time, I am, uh, I am finishing my work uh, in the company that I work for. And then I'm, uh, whatever time is left in the evening, so I'm focusing on, uh, you know, like trying to, to contact a, a colleague who is helping me to set my, my Facebook and Insta page. Uh, uh, I am also with my mentor, uh, you know, doing my NLP and emotional intelligence uh, uh, kind of work. So I am for uh, my Reiki and healing work as well. So I am actually also finding some two, three hours in the evening late where I'm actually also doing and taking courses uh, for my own business. So I am taking the knowledge for now. So I'm studying as much as I can. And now I finished everything. I got all my certificates, which is good. But now I need to put it into practice and open this business. And at the same time, I feel like I'm procrastinating in the sense of I'm not sure why, but I am so exhausted having to juggle with, you know, doing things for my own business when how many uh, how, how much time do I have will I have enough confidence to do it uh, can I uh, uh, will clients come to me uh, uh, how can I charge how much can I charge uh, so those type of blockages that I am facing and then at the same time especially that in my current job I have a very good salary and I'm very well paid um, which gives you a bit of comfort you know like I'm leaving a very good salary and a very good I mean a job I'm not happy with at all, and it's not at all motivating me, but it's at least the pay is good. So yeah. that is actually a bit worrying me on how am I going to leave that and open a new business from scratch, um, and w- uh, whether it's going to work or not. Will I have enough confidence to, to, to do it? Do I have enough, uh, you know, like, is it going to be sustainable? Mm-hmm. Yes. Uh, there are all these different questions going on in your mind and I can just imagine that it creates a lot of overwhelm and maybe also some kind of um, like a fog almost like it's hard to see what what are the right steps to take would that be a correct description yes that's perfect what are the steps to take and how to take them what is the first step I need to do uh, uh, as you correctly said where will I start from where to start yeah. Uh, what steps to take yeah, yeah. Exactly. well and we will fix this for you during today so what uh, what does your ideal vision as you as a mother look like because as you said you are pregnant and you, you want what, what kind of like what would a happy life as a mother look like for you how much do you work what kind of work do you do how much time do you have for your children etc yeah so uh, I would like to so thank you one more time. Uh, thanks to you, you helped me <laughs> become pregnant. 
And uh, through the two sessions that I have done with you, actually, uh, the first one, we, we uh, you know, you helped me, you know, know what was stopping me from getting pregnant. You know, the, the feeling of uh, being good enough and uh, uh, knowing my truth and what is my truth. So in that journey of knowing what, what my truth is and the promise I made uh, to myself uh, uh, during the session and to my daughter, uh, you know, to find time for her and to, to at the same time work and enjoy it, but also enjoy quality time with my baby. So uh, in the second session, uh, I also saw uh, this door where I was actually very nicely seated at home. I, I, as you recall, so I was in a, in a, at my home uh, in the luxury of my home working and my, my children were, were actually, you know, like uh, in front of me in the house, like jumping around and I, can, I could see them. And at the same time I was working, but I didn't feel stressed. I felt so chill, relaxed, enjoying actually what I'm doing. So I felt like I was combining. So this is what I would like to do. To, 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 to have a job where I have free time for myself and for my children, where I can actually work while watching them, you know, um, and not uh, work from morning till evening. Yeah, that, definitely not. And also find a job where I am happy. Yeah. Uh, and those things I'm, uh, that I'm working uh, to achieve now in my new business are things that I love to do. And uh, they're my passion. And I would love to help others actually find their way and deal with their emotions and the way they, you know, deal with their minds and their thoughts and, you know, and uh, the energy body. So all that healing work as well, so yeah. that everyone who is in that state could actually feel, you know, chilled. And yeah, so, yeah, I would definitely not want to continue working from morning till evening and not having time for myself and for my children so that has to stop for yeah. yeah amazing so i i think that that is exactly what we what we need to know before we before we start the session so we know that you are starting with these feelings of oh yeah actually one more question so we know that you are starting with this feeling of a bit of frustration and like fogginess and not knowing what steps to take and overwhelm frustration all of this and we know that you want to go to the happiness, the freedom, the joy, the passion and time for your children and yourself. So on a scale from one to 10, like how stuck do you feel in those like hard emotions right now? Uh, I would say like two weeks back, I was maybe eight over 10 stuck. Uh, but then, uh, you know, uh, thanks to talking to you and to the healing work that I did also on myself. So I feel, I still feel stuck, I, like six, seven over 10, actually. I am taking a few steps, but still I'm not moving towards, uh, it's not getting any better. Yeah. Yeah. Fantastic. So our goal is to truly figure out what, why have you been feeling this overwhelmed feeling and this procrastination, and then we want to free you from that so that you can go on and create your ideal family life with your business, right? <laughs> Amazing. Yes, yes. Fantastic. So I will just stop the recording and then we will follow up with you a few days after we do this um, this session. It was now like but five days ago since we did your session. How do you feel now? Uh, uh, I feel very, very uh, relaxed. Like I can, I really feel um, an amazing uh, shift in, in, uh, in the energies, honestly. Like very, very peaceful, very relaxed. I'm not usually that peaceful and that relaxed. So I kind of like really felt it like very, very uh, chilled. So uh, it helped a lot. And also like uh, the thoughts are, are uh, no longer you remember before the call I was very stressed so many thoughts coming in out from where to start what to do so now uh, as you told me I'm like doing things step by step focusing on what's important giving time for myself so it's uh, it helped me uh, sort out my 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 thoughts nicely without stressing about it and my tasks mm -hmm. you know it sounds like you have gained a lot of clarity is that correct uh, yes, I yes, this is exactly it. So I gained a lot of clarity on uh, on uh, what to do, how to do things, on not to overstress about it. So yeah, I got a lot of uh, insight and clarity. On uh, I understood that I don't need to you know worry about all those steps all at a time. Each step 
unfolds one after the other. When you open one door, you see another one. So that was very powerful, actually. And things happen for a reason, like you were saying. So I would like to share also with you that. Um, so basically, remember in, in my uh, nice session with you. Uh, so I saw myself in the future being able to stand on a stand and to have some people, you know, uh, to whom I'm talking. And I kind of like loved the idea, but I'm like, I was thinking still, like, how is it going to happen? So I got a call two days ago from a colleague with whom I haven't spoke since ages and who saw my post on the seminar that I'm doing. And he told me, uh, we are doing, uh, you know, for the Lebanese diaspora. We have a Lebanese diaspora in Dubai, where I am now. And he would like me to speak on stage uh, uh, about emotional intelligence, I swear. And I'm like, what? And he's like, yeah, you know, we have like 100, 150 people, uh, <laughs> lawyers, young lawyers, you know, who are confused and stressed and stuff. And the, the topic of emotional intelligence is going to help them. It's very interesting. No one in the field uh, of lawyers has talk, has spoken about it. So, yeah, so I'm like, oh, my God, I'm going to tell Linda this is, this is you know, like... Um, one of the uh, options that like opened up for me um, because you really saw yourself like in the hypnosis who went into the future you saw yourself exactly. the animal state exactly it's coming through thanks to the clarity that uh, that you gave me so i saw myself and it's coming yeah it's, it's happening so i'm like oh okay that's nice a very fast yeah. manifestation like three two or three days after the timing was perfect. It was a very fast manifestation, yes. Yeah, so that was very powerful. Amazing. So how did you feel during the session? Because some people, they have not done, you know, hypnosis before and they feel like, well, can Linda control my mind? Or, you know, they have fear. How, yes. how was it? So uh, I, I am someone who uh, always uh, would like to keep control of things. Like uh, I have to be in control of everything I do and things. So in your session, what's amazing uh, uh, in your session and the way you actually guide us, you are always in control. So I would like to say to everybody that you are in control. It's not like you go in hypnosis and you lose it. So, so you are actually literally in control. You are not uh, sleeping uh, like uh, in the session. You are actually aware and uh, just connecting more deeply into your subconscious mind, but you are totally uh, uh, the one who is seeing things. So you guide us through the process, but we are the ones who see things, who do things, who tell you what we see, and you help us step by step. So it's a process where actually you don't even think whether you're losing or gaining control. It's so smooth and so nicely done um, through your voice and you know the, the, the amazing ideas that you, you, you put through. So there is nothing about, uh, you know, like losing it or uh, losing control or uh, some hocus pocus magic. It's uh, it's on the contrary. <laughs> it's a very yeah. smooth, nice, nice process. It's very smooth and you are totally aware and awake and uh, in control of, uh, you know, like doing uh, doing the steps, seeing everything. It's just it, it's just that you are really relaxed and enjoying so it's very, yeah. it's a very nice, yeah, pleasant. Yeah. Yeah. How did you feel like right when you came out of the hypnosis and when we had cleared a lot of things? How did it feel for you straight after? Straight, straight after, you feel like really, um, now it depends on, um, so, so I would like to say to uh, whomever is listening to us, who would be listening, that, I mean, it depends on the, matter uh, that has been that we discovered together you and me, me in the session but each time you get out of the session and especially this one that i did you feel like like, like uh, a weight of 50 kgs that have been completely released out of like you really feel amazing relaxed like like all the 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 heavy kgs that you were carrying completely vanish you i felt very empowered very relaxed and uh, without any heavy weight. Uh, and I was in a very nice, amazing, relaxed, positive attitude and mood directly after the, the session. And across, so for the past five days, I've been uh, very relaxed and in a good mood. And, yeah. Fantastic. Yeah. And how does it feel to be listening to your personalized recording? 
it's a very nice experience actually uh, because it makes you it makes you uh, remember uh, the, the nice session that you had uh, and in my case the nice session I had with you so I remember um, the whole uh, you know uh, what was the story about what, how we, did we you know um, the amazing things uh, that happened in the session and then it, it, it's like uh, uh, your voice is amazing and and uh, and uh, the thoughts you know like the affirmations and the thoughts that you say to your mind so when you listen to it every day it feels very relaxing and very empowering and i i am getting day after day more clarity um so each time i i listen to the recording i have a different idea uh, something new unfolds even though it's the same recording but you get new ideas day after day so I, i'm like oh yeah you get you get new messages sometimes you know you would be maybe listening to it before you sleep so maybe you would have slept something would have uh, would have uh, slept uh, you know like slipped you wouldn't have paid attention to it but your subconscious mind would but the next day you're like like this is what i felt like oh okay so that idea is very nice you know opening one door and then you get a message and then you open the next door so that one for example when i first read uh, heard the, the the recording i didn't pay attention to attention to it so each time you listen to the recording you get empowered and it piles up empowerment on, on top of empowerment. And it's just in, in the beginning of your listening process. So we always say like listen for 21 days. So now you're like five days in or something. So just imagine yes. like when it goes for the, for the whole 21 days. So were you surprised with what your subconscious mind showed to you? Because we, we wanted to release this feeling of procrastination and fear and, and like fogginess of not knowing what to do and overwhelm. Were you surprised with what your subconscious mind showed you? I was actually surprised in which uh, I was surprised uh, um, how, how, you know, like what my subconscious mind showed me. I mean, it's so powerful how interesting your subconscious mind takes you to specific events that happened in your past which make a lot of sense regarding the topic that you're uh, like for me, for example, the uh, like, uh, you know, the fact that the pro procrastination and the fact that uh, I want to which, uh, uh, you know, step to take, etc. cetera. I, I was overwhelmed, etc. So my subconscious mind surprised me because it took me to a situation where I, in my life I was really the most overwhelmed. Um, and then it took me to another situation which showed my, the qualities of determination and so it all it all makes sense so it's so interesting mm. how the subconscious mind selects the exact events that serve that serve you for for um, you know and help you remember and help you actually understand what is waiting for you also in the future so it's yeah. it's, it's great because you never actually for example this event about me of eight years old i forgot about it so but my subconscious mind didn't so it surprised me that it selected this specific amazing event of where i was determined to go on stage and to, uh, actually i was talking about it with my mother today she told me not that they selected you out of so many so many kids uh, so so they saw that talent in you because sometimes you know we sabotage ourselves it makes sense now also after the recording like to focus as you were telling me like all all this determination that i have and and you know at, at work and that i'm focusing on it using it in, at work i can use it to do my business so it makes sense and i feel it doesn't anymore make you feel um I'm no longer overwhelmed thinking where to start and what to do. It's like one step at a time, things are opening up uh, in a very nice way. Would you say that that is impacting your whole life when you are now feeling calmer and you are, you are pregnant and we already know it? So how does this whole thing impact you to just be able to feel calm and just see things more clear? Someone who does meditation and uh, I am doing, you know, an LP and emotional intelligence and all this. So all those tools that I learned, you know, help me uh, to get calm. But the difference in, in this session and in doing the session and in hypnosis is that actually it's effortless. 
You know, like when I sit, for example, to do some uh, meditation, I'm making an effort to sit into meditation to, you know, and then, okay, eventually I'll get calm after you. But after your session, it was effortless. It was uh, like now I feel calm without making any effort of sitting, let's say, in meditation or of uh, calming my... It's it's just so effortless, so nice and smooth. And it's uh, this is, again, a surprise of, of your subconscious mind, how, how you know, when how it helps you clear this weight I was talking about that got re uh, removed in the session. So it's really removed. So it, it keeps you in a constant state of uh, calmness and, uh, you know, relaxation. So, um, and determination. So, yeah. yeah. And a specific case that you were also describing when you were eight years old, because this is so interesting with the mind, how you, when you were eight years old, had the situation that was a very, like every normal kind of situation. So it wasn't a big trauma or anything like that, but it was a quite like normal situation. And your mind as an eight year old picked up a certain understanding of that situation. And now when we were able to view it and you could view it as the adult you, you could see it from a brand new perspective and just make a brand new understanding from it. And that's so incredibly, incredible, interesting. And that new understanding have created a brand new path in, in your reality. Yes, actually, uh, thank you for mentioning that. Actually, that was another surprise for me. Uh, and you helped me out uh, uh, seeing that this way. So basically for me, it was like uh, when I first, uh, when, my, when my subconscious mind took me to that particular event, uh, when I was actually... Uh, so for, for people who are listening, so basically when I was eight years old, I was sitting on the floor mm -hmm. in the living room with my mother and brother, and I was listening to myself. She, my mom was making us listen to me uh, rehearsing for a poem to the site uh, in front of all mm -hmm. the school. And I was thinking mm -hmm. always like, wow, my, uh, it took me 10, 15, 20 times for me to rehearse and to remember this poem. So I had kind of a negative connotation about it. Like it takes me a lot of time for me to be able to, you know, uh, uh, memorize. Whereas my brother who was four years younger, you know, like he, 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 he just picked it up in a second. So that was the first. Uh, so you helped me out and, and, and through the whole session, I understood and got more clarity as you're saying that basically it's my quality, that basically I have been rehearsing and rehearsing and focusing and repeating. And this is actually a quality uh, that I have within me. And uh, now I have a different perspective, as you said, when I look back and think, actually, it's true. It's this determination that I tend to forget that I have and that, you know, every person has different things, different, uh, you know, uh, skills. So now that I look at it, it makes sense that, wow, actually, yes, you know, it, it's actually this determination from the, the year of eight years old till now that have brought me where I am today. So I look at it now in such, as you said, different perspectives. So this is, again, uh, 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 the magic that, that you do in, uh, with us in the, in the session. Uh, now that I realize it consciously, making me move uh, forward. So thank you for that, yeah. When your mind saw it as a weakness that it believed before that, oh, it takes her so long to learn and, and all that, that created a negative experience in your whole reality. And you had this belief about yourself that I'm so slow and all of this and better not to start anywhere because it's just going to be overwhelming. And now when your mind well, understands like, oh, that's actually my strength, that now you realize I can do anything. And this is why your whole reality is shifting now because you're realizing that, whoa, I can actually build my whole company. I can speak on stage. And it's, it's so amazing. It is. Yes, it is. It's a whole shift, correct? It's a whole shift of this negative belief that I had, which has now turned into actually a positive resource uh, that, ha that I have within me and that I can use now that I have more clarity about it. So this shift, as you said, uh, happened in this session and it's actually really amazing. And it's effortless as well, as I was saying also. Yeah, it has become your superpower now, your determination <laughs> and your willingness yes, to study. Yes, yes. <laughs> I, uh, I'm loving it also because I remember what you said, like all this focus, now you, you instead of focusing um, 
using this focus and determination at your current job that you would want to leave. And it took you very, very, um, to very high levels in your work, that focus, so, and to success in the current job that you would, that no longer serves me. So that same focus, I can take it and put it into my business. So I'm no longer afraid uh, after the session, you know, I have this clarity that that same focus, if I focus, use it actually to, to build my business, it will, it will lead me to that amazing success and to that amazing picture that uh, thanks to your session I saw of me speaking on stage and, and uh, you know, it's very powerful when you project and you see actually your dreams in front of you um, and, lo and listening to the recording, as you said, day after day makes this manifestation even stronger and stronger. So it's very nice. Yeah. Yeah, I get a goosebumps as you speak because I can see, like, I can see your future like one year from now. Just, just imagine, like, it's incredible what you are going to do in this world. Yes, yes, we'll meet one day on stage. <laughs> yeah, we for sure will. What? So, so I remember I asked you before the session, and I asked about the scale, and I said like, if if one was, I think, like feeling very frustrated and very stuck, and ten was super free and just knowing that hey I'm on my way where where would you say that you are now from from one to ten on that scale that is the most stressful than I, I have given you before the session uh, around eight so now it's four and a half so um, meaning one being not stressed so four is is very good when it was eight which was extremely stressed before yeah yeah amazing do you think that anybody else who is struggling with procrastination, feeling overwhelmed, not knowing what to do, have a job or wanting to leave, wanting to create something on their own, do you think that they would benefit from a session like this? Of course, uh, I actually uh, would invite everyone to, 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 to have that session. Uh, it was really very, 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 very helpful. I mean, I am waking up. Basically, after the session, you have you have uh, also given me the idea through the session and after it that every every uh, morning when you wake up and you know like uh, you take a pen and you write down you know like those ideas that are coming after you listen to a recording you have an idea so you write it down on a piece of paper and you 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 decide what is the intention uh, that you would like for your day. So the, the, the moment you have that intention and uh, of your day and you have all those thoughts that you would want to accomplish, you kind of feel that, okay, it's not that stressful. It's not, it's, it's okay. So what is my priority today? I take care of myself so I can take care of others. So have all those nice ideas and this nice intention for the day. Everything unfolds. So that understanding, you would, you would get it even, I mean, People might know it, but like it's so powerful when you experience it in the session and it helps you really move out of procrastination and understand that it's not about failing, as the recording says. So we all, I mean, we all make mistakes and we learn from our mistakes. So basically the person who fails is the person who doesn't take action. So the moment that you are empowered through this recording into, you know, taking action, I am taking action and I'm surprised, like, again, how the subconscious mind and this amazing session, effort uh, without any effort helped me, like, waking up, I write down what I would like to do, etc. And then things start happening. It's about taking one step after the other. So I recommend uh, every person who is into that situation who wants to leave a current job that is not serving him anymore who doesn't have the courage to do that uh, uh, who is feeling that he's uh, procrastinating to actually take the session and to understand why this is happening and clearly and then through your help to actually feel empowered on uh, uh, you know and successful in uh, taking the, the steps that they want to take. So, so how would you say that it has been to work with me both, both as a person and as a hypnotherapist? Have you felt safe and good? <laughs> uh, yes, so to be honest, um, I, I have told you and I, have, and I repeat it again, like from the second I came across 
our, uh, you know, your uh, your profile and uh, I contacted you and you took the time to send me so many, so many uh, videos, you know, like uh, wanting to know what's the, what's the method and how you can help and etc. So all that devotion that you have put before even I started one session with you and then the continuous follow up and care you know usually you go you pay some consultant whatever you get the, the whatever advice or the therapy you need and then you leave there is no follow up there's no so thank you so much so I don't consider you as a, as my therapist more than uh, like I, I mean you are but like I consider you as a friend you make you, you connect so deeply to 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 and you enter you entered my heart and I'm sure everyone knows how you enter everyone's heart so the connection is very nice. And I would like to thank you also that you care really and genuinely about your clients. So it's, and you genuinely always remember. Um, so you don't care about quantity. It's more the quality of the clients that you do. You, and you focus on asking about us. Uh, so I have met you three, four months ago. And every day, at least once a week, you send me a message. You ask about me. So so it's so nice. And I like even close friends don't do that. So, of course, that is really, I uh, I mean, I feel really connected to you. And thank you so, so much for that. So, uh, I'm yeah. I'm really happy that you feel that way. Yeah. Yeah, it, it's something so beautiful when we get to do this work and really connect with people on such a deep level to make sure that we are yeah. changing lives. And I know that that is what you will be go, going out and doing in this world with, yeah. with women or people that you are going to help. Um, so yeah, I'm so grateful that we have met. I'm so grateful too. Thank you so, so much, Linda. And honestly, uh, thank you so, so much for everything. Uh, for the connection, for the devotion, for, for, for the, yeah, honestly, you really genuinely care from the heart, you know, like so many other therapists, because I've met many, I mean, everyone does whatever the best they can, but like, you know, like some people like, okay, they, they want clients or they don't have time enough, they have, you know, so for you, despite, uh, you know, your busy schedule, you always make sure to drop a message to all your clients and to make sure and follow up and ask it if you can help them out and how are things happening. So you, you keep that amazing uh, contact, um, which which actually makes me feel that you're really serving from your heart, everybody, and you're coming from the heart. So thank, thank you so you. much. That's yeah. that's very nice. <laughs> thank you so much. And it was thank also so great you. that you did let me say hi to your husband today as well, so that I could see yes, the father yes. of the child. <laughs> Yes, he's uh, he's so grateful as well. He told you anyway <laughs> before, before. Uh, yeah, he, uh, he's so very grateful also, and he he's telling me, you know, like uh, I'm so grateful that um, you met Linda. So this is also here. I would like to say it with um, a message. Like sometimes, you know, um, I don't like to generalize, but you know, for any every woman who's trying to get pregnant or to leave her job or to find, like you might have. Your husband, like maybe, you know, who has more of a mathematical brain and who would tell you like, okay, what are those therapies? How can they help you out, etc. So my husband has also seen, uh, uh, has always encouraged me. And not only that, he has seen the shift himself in my uh, uh, in before and after the session. And he's like, that's why he's like, I'm so great, <laughs> Linda, you know, like, um, even though I had different therapists before, I mean, he, he doesn't, he tells me, he doesn't give me his opinion, usually. It means that he's not that graceful about them. But like, <laughs> for you, he's like, I'm so grateful that Linda is, is uh, you know, with you um, and, um, you know, helping you out and all that amazing work that we are having together. So, yeah, he's, um, he could also see the shift and is, he is also very grateful. Amazing, yeah. amazing. Yeah. Thank you so truly much for sharing this with me. It means a lot. <laughs> Thank you so much, Linda, to you as well. Yeah. I wish you a super, super beautiful night and uh, we will catch up very soon again. Okay. <laughs> Have a beautiful day. Bye. Yeah.